Now turn to section 3. Section 3. In this section, you will hear a discussion between a college receptionist, Denise, and a student named Vijay about learning a language. In the first part of the discussion, they are talking about the course Vijay will study. First look at questions 25 to 29. Note the examples that have been done for you. Using no more than three words or numbers, complete the table. Hello. May I help you? Hello. Uh, is this the right place for me to register to study foreign languages? Yes, it is. May I have your name, please? Vijay. My family name is Paresh. Vijay Paresh. OK. Do you have a telephone number? Yeah. 909-2467. Thank you. Now, which language would you like to learn? We offer French, Italian, Cantonese, Mandarin, Spanish, Portuguese. Um, I'd like to learn Spanish, please. OK. Our classes are conducted in lots of different places. We have classrooms in the city and here in this building. Well, what's this building called? This is Building A. Oh. I work near here, so it'd be best to study in Building A. What time do you want to come to lessons? They go on for three hours and they start at 10 a.m., 4 p.m. and 6 p.m. I wish I could come to the daytime lessons, but I can't. So 6 p.m., please. That's our most popular time, of course. Um, have you ever studied Spanish before? No, I haven't. We describe our classes by level and number. Your class is called Elementary 1. OK. Uh, when will classes start? Elementary one begins... Uh, just a minute. Uh, it begins on August 10. Great. Now what else do I have to do? Now look at questions 30 to 32. Choose the appropriate letters A to D and write them in boxes 30 to 32 on your answer sheet. Listen carefully to the conversation between Denise and Vijay and Anne. Well, let's see. First you have to go to... May I have a minute, please, Denise? Of course, Anne. Excuse me for a minute, please, Vijay. Did you file those forms for me last night? Uh, no, they're still on my desk. Oh, Denise, that's simply not good enough. I'm really sorry, Anne. It won't happen again. All right, Denise, go back to your customer, but please be more careful in future. Now listen to the directions and match the places in questions 33 to 36 to the appropriate letters A to H on the plan. I'm sorry, Vijay. What were you saying? I wanted to know what else I had to do. Oh, of course. Please go to the building on the other side of Smith Street. I want you to go to the reception area first. It's just inside the door on the left as you enter from Smith Street. Give them this form. OK. Do I pay my fees there? No, but the fees office is in the same building. Go past the escalators and you'll see a games shop. It's in the corner. The fees office is between the games shop and the toilets. Thanks. Uh, where can I buy books? The bookshop is opposite the lifts. It's right next to the entrance from Robert Street. Your offices are spread out. Not as badly as they used to be. By the way, we offer very competitive overseas travel rates to our students. Oh. I'd like to look into that. Of course. The travel agency is at the Smith Street end of the building. 
in the corner next to the insurance office. Thank you very much. Bye. This is the end of section three. You will now have some time to check your answers.